in the darkness of night. A spark of consciousness in the toy light. Oh! And it worked. Let's see, come over here. Neither Tweedledee nor Tweedledum. Don't do anything rash, Snow Maiden. I have a surprise for you. No, 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 no. Bunny? No, 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 no. Alive? Yes, I brought him to life. And unless you bring the magical keys to the abandoned toy factory, you will never see your bunny. Pillow fighting. <laughs> Take this! Uh, uh, no way, Valerie! Using magic is against the rules. Well, I'm gonna teach you a lesson. <laughs> Ow! You're behaving like kids! Ow! Oh, I'm not gonna let this slide. Uh, Ow! Take <laughs> this! <laughs> 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 Why are you sitting there? Come join us. Oh. Hey, go away! Valerie, do something about this big eater. He's got his paws on the cake. Oh, the cake. Drakey, go to your place. Helena, shall we go set off some fireworks? Any cake? Pretty. Okay, do it, Helena. It's a good time to see you launch those magical sparks. Okay, 
One sec. Oh, I forgot to sample to my purse. My poor bunny. Oh, I love you so much. But if I give the keys to the Phantom, Helena will never be able to go to the fairy tale world and find her parents. No, I cannot do it. Bunny, I will save you myself. Snowy, are you serious? You really wanted to go fight the Phantom on your own? And you thought we'd let you go alone? Oh, girls, I'm so sorry, but he's got my bunny. Wait, what bunny? Snowy's bunny. Cheer up. We'll get him back. Do you roger me, girls? I'm at the place. How's the picture? Snowy, the picture's good. You can go in, but be careful. Can't see anyone so far. <gasps> Bunny! So, Snow Maiden. <laughs> As you see, I kept my word. But do you have the keys? Yes, I do. Here! Put them in here. Snowy, try to find out where the Phantom's hiding. Must be somewhere close. Where is he? Where is he? Aww, we're gonna lose our keys! It looks like there's some movement on the right side. Snowy, turn around. That way. Let's teleport there. Valerie, grab it! Helena, catch! No one's here. So where's the phantom? She obviously got scared and ran away. That's strange. I didn't expect it to go this easy. My bunny. Tricky, what are you doing? This is my bunny. Tricky, hush. Go to your place. Come on, Drakey, don't be jealous. I love you just as much. It's so strange. The bunny's alive now. Where have you been all this time? Quite a traveler. Thank you so much, girls. You don't know how happy this makes me. Okay, missies, let's start tea partying already, because uh, I'm getting very sleepy weepy. <laughs> to me. Bring me the bracelets. just sleep at night. First, they bring home pets, and now I'm the one who has to look after this bunch of weird creatures. <laughs> Finally! The keys are mine! <laughs> Get away from me, you flying piece of wither! Drakey, I guess I should start working on making you a real fighter dragon. Bunny, what's...
What's wrong with you? It looks like your bunny has been bewitched. Okay, all right. The siren's magical ribbon, capable of taking the free will from any creature. Mm. Powerful thing. Ah, and now it's gone. This powerful thing. <laughs> uh. Come on. Our home has become some sort of magical zoo. <laughs> This isn't a mistake. Is this the right place? In its riddle, the Mirror of Prophecy said that the key is located in the magic forest. Uh, it doesn't look very magical to me. Quite stumped. Quiet, everyone. Hear that? Coming from there. But this is Ayaya Dakilev, Morimsi Sirpim. Whoa, Mary knows another language? Yeah, Mary was a straight A student in magical languages. In Zish Kavaret Ogligot, in the rock, Dinavazoso, Igasotos. Teu, Pilitokiavi, Sivarsi Mijomimkak. Utov Yisarev, in Nirp. Timbigo fasisal in vasisim. Min isafid if ah. Mary! Mary! Hey, what did she say? Apparently, this is Dryad, the guardian of the magic forest. That bunny is a villain who damaged the tree of life. The forest is dying. So it was the phantom? But we didn't know. Mary! You should tell her that we didn't mean to! We are the fantasy patrol! She doesn't believe us. So now I have to go and bring the water of life. Otherwise, you'll stay in the forest forever. Fluffy, you can come out. Huh. So where are we supposed to look for that water of life? Okay, let's see. Aqua Vivum. All right. H2O, Argentum. Okay. Oh, I get it. The water of life is supposed to give off invisible shining. Well, that's just great. If the water is invisible, how are we supposed to see it? We need to get to a higher ground. Asel tam, overhead ikelove, san ikadi open. Hey, Val. Psst, what is she doing? I don't know. Making some kind of spell, I think. She's probably trying to help the tree. <laughs> you know, Mary, I'm a mouse, I'm not a squirrel. Come on, Fluffy, don't be scared. We can see the entire forest from here. All right. There! Got it! That way! Ah! Huh? What if Mary doesn't find that water? What's gonna happen? Nothing much. She'd just turn us into tree stumps. Oh, 
Oh, but I don't want to be a tree stump. Quiet. Hear that? Someone's coming. <gasps> That's the wood sprite! Hello! Over here! Help us! Yeesha? Itote? Should be somewhere close. <laughs> oh, hello there. We're looking for the water of life. Do you know where we can find it? <laughs> of course I do. Why wouldn't I? I've been guarding it uh, for about three centuries. I'm sorry, but we really need the water of life. You see, there's this tree, and it's dying. Just look at her go. No water for you, period. I said period. Is that so? In that case, we'll take it ourselves. Like some buffoon can stop us. <laughs> what are you doing? This is for the magical tree. If the tree dies, the whole forest will go down with it. <laughs> <laughs> Hilarious. Haven't had so much fun in a while. Oh, just you wait. I'll show him. I'll make that whistler pay. Ugh. Wait now, Fluffy. We cannot do it by force. We need a method. <gasps> Tell me, young lady, what is this marvelous music? Huh, this? These are masters of musical whistling. Internet celebrities, by the way, very well known. Hmm, impressive. What a show. And I can do this. There, all done. Whoa, that's a lot of comments. You made a great show. What's that now? Is that addressed to me? Yes, look how many fans you've got already. Mr. Whistler, so how about that water of life? Uh, the shelf, you'll see it there. Thank you, Mr. Whistler. Good afternoon, my dear fellow. Ooh, where's the W? Hmm? Ha! Ha! Uh, we should have asked Mr. Whistler for an autograph. What if he actually becomes famous? Quiet. Hear that? Someone's moaning. Oh, a deer. You poor thing. Hang in there, sweetie. We're gonna help you. Dear, is he gonna die? No, Fluffy. We're gonna save him. Yeah, but what about the girls? <sighs> the key should be somewhere here. <laughs> Stop it! Don't you dare kill that tree! You're hurting it! <sighs> I wish I had my bracelet! Then I could stop all of this! Girls, Dryad, this is bad. The Phantom's back. The keys! Fluffy, I know what to do. We'll get help from Mr. Whistler. Stop, Phantom! Ha! <laughs> and who's gonna stop me? You? Pipsqueak? <laughs> no, Mary! Run! You can't do it alone! Good thing I'm not alone. Mr. Whistler, it's your cue! Huh? <laughs> All right. 
I guess you won. But I will be back! Water? I'm afraid I don't have any water left. Tom Yakirep, Yari Misin in! I'm so sorry. Dear, you came here? This is... But this is the spirit of the forest. Please rise, my child. For your kind heart and your pure soul, I entrust you with the key of the earth. Take good care of it, and use it only for honorable deeds. Thank you so much, Mighty Father. Disappointing me. They found three keys already. I ask you for one last chance, my master. I will not let you down. Hey, Blue. Oh, we're late. She got married. Yellow? Well, love, she fell asleep. <laughs> and you, Green? She's too much food. <sighs> huh? I did it! I got one! Good at rollerblading. If you want, we can practice it together. Helena gave me a couple of lessons. Wow, I'm doing it! Finally! <laughs> <laughs> Yay! <laughs> Thank you so much. Listen, what do alien girls think about eating ice cream? Well, I don't know about aliens, but I would love to have one right now. Creme brulee would be great. Creme brulee? That's my favorite, too. You just... Don't go anywhere, okay? I'll be right back. I'll be quick. One moment. He's <laughs> such a funny guy. Ah, Cody! Uh, Snowy? Snowy! Where are you? Snowy, I'm coming! I'm here! Oh, what if there are aliens there? I don't even have a blaster. What should I do? Helena, I can't believe it. Five hot dogs in one sitting. That wasn't me! Hey, you! Come here! And hurry! This is where she was dragged to. I wanted to go in, but my mom doesn't allow me to climb into wells and pits. Okay, all right. Entry 37. Snowy was kidnapped by dwarves. The question is why. We need to figure it out. Let's go. And me? What should I do? And you, Peterson. Stay here. Guard the hole. Here. 
This is also for you, Your Majesty Snowy White. Thank you, kind dwarfs. The gems are really pretty, but I'm not Snow White. I'm simply Snowy. Oh. Your Majesty, please don't go. Stay here with us, kind Snowy White. We really, really like you. <laughs> Dear dwarfs, I cannot stay here. Well, maybe you can be our guest for just a little bit. Pretty, 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 please. <laughs> All right, dear dwarfs, I will stay with you till the evening. This place looks nice. And what is this? Oh, this is the royal ruby. The biggest and most beautiful ruby in the world. In the past, it used to be the most important treasure of our kings. But then it disappeared. We've been looking for it ever since. But we still cannot find it. <laughs> oh, wow! This is what I call a big cave! Fellow walked along the road, and then he saw a piece of gold. He bought a violin and a bow. That's the snow he does now. <laughs> oh, what is that? That's uh, nothing important. Something must have broken in the tunnel. We're gonna fix it. Snowball by Bunny Lip. He loved his mistress oh so what? Bunny is cute. Bunny is cute. That's the snow he does now. Bearded creatures. This is King Glom the Third. Helena, actually, we came here to rescue Snowy. Quiet. Do you hear that, girls? Aha! Dwarves! <laughs> you have kidnapped our Snowy. Tell us where she is this instant. Uh, it wasn't us. It's all those pestilent miners. What miners are you talking about? We saw them dragging away this little girl. She had blonde hair. If you want, we can show you the way. And you guard the hole. You think I'm a coward? No. Cody Peterson will show you what he can do. The hero of Earth. Let's go. <laughs> There, we've arrived. The miner's cave is at the bottom. This way. Wow, that is really deep. Thank you. Helena, you should go first. Oh, I can't see anything. <laughs> you two-faced liars, ugly, wicked dumplings. You're gonna pay for this! <laughs> This place must be an abandoned mine. Oh, right, all right, all right. There has to be a way out. Oh, Valerie, do you think that you could maybe teleport us out of here? No, Helena. Teleportation doesn't work underground. No, but that means that we're going to be stuck in this place forever. <laughs> Calm down, Helena. I've got an idea. Mine carts, they can take us out. We just need to get this gate to open. And how are we going to get it open? We need to fire up this boiler. working at all. Mary, you have the key of the earth. Ha, that's right! Come on, tell these stupid stones they need to move. Okay, I'm gonna try. This is an underground alien base, and these are definitely their leaders. Oh! <laughs> hmm, and what is this thing here? I 
bet it's something extraterrestrial. You? Peterson? What are you doing here? I came here to save Snowy. Just look at this, Savior! It's ending! Thank you, dear dwarfs, but I should go. Huh? Oh, lovely Snowy White, why don't you stay with us a little longer? Huh? <laughs> well then, the wish of our queen is our command. If you want to go home, we'll show you the way. <laughs> Snowy White is ours. You will never be able to find her. No one can find a way out of our cage. <laughs> there has to be something we can do. I have an idea. All right, girls. Give me all the valuables you've got on you. These are dwarves. They'll give up everything for shiny trinkets. Here. We're exchanging these treasures for our Snowy. <laughs> <laughs> this is what you're calling treasures? This is worthless trash. Here, to save Snowy, I will do anything. <gasps> is this really the royal ruby? We've been looking for you for centuries. You've, You've returned, returned to, to us. us. Not so fast. How about first you give us our Snowy? <laughs> You're gonna regret what you've done. Yeah. Peterson, swear that you won't talk to anyone about what you saw. I swear. No one will believe me anyway. All right, we should go now, girls. Snowy! I wanted to ask, can extraterrestrial girls be friends with boys from this planet? Extraterrestrial? <laughs> but of course, Cody. <gasps> Thank you for your help. 